What's up guys, Alex here with UKMG Webcast number 63 for a week beginning June the 2nd, 2014. So last week's releases we had the Blue Exis movie, Fate Zero Part 2, High School DXD The Complete Fair Series Collection, High School DXD Volume 1, My Little Monster Volume 2, Quella Magic Kazumi Magica Volume 5, The Melancholy of Haruhi Suzumaya Volume 18, The Wallflower Volume 32, Triage X Volume 6, until Death Do Us Part Volume 6, Attack on Titan The Colossal Edition Volume 1, and Cage of Eden Volume 14. We actually have a little collector's edition of the Blue Exes movie right here, and we are going to uh, opening right now, because I got it last Friday. I did it from base.com, but it took a little while to get here, so I thought, you know what, since I'm pretty much going to do webcast in the next couple of days, do a quick little opening whilst you know, it's this pretty cool little hard, well it's not really that hard, like a cardboard collector's edition case and a bit of Blu-ray. And on the inside we have two discs and some of the postcards. It looks like the inside of the case is actually reversible as well. So you can have it without all of the Peggy 15, it's not Peggy 15 is it? So yeah, let's quickly open up these. So yeah, first up you get a art card of the True Cross Academy Town, which is pretty cool. And then you get some like concept artwork. Let's get the roof sketch of the concept artwork. And then you get one of some of the trams and stuff like that. It's not gonna make my life easy by focusing. And then some of the Demon slash monster, which starts off in the, the Phantom Train, that's the one. So, yeah, that's uh, some concept artwork of the Phantom Train. So, that's a pretty cool little class edition. So, right on with the webcast. So, for this week on Monday, the 2nd of June, today we have Fairy Tale Collection 2. This is on Blu ray and contains episodes 25 to 48 on four discs. And then we have Outlaw Star, the complete collection on DVD. This contains all 26 episodes of the series across six discs. And then on Tuesday the 3rd of June tomorrow we have A Centaur's Life Volume 3, Alice in the Country of Joker, Sex and the Liars Game Volume 5, and Girls and Panzer Volume 1. And on Thursday the 5th of June we have Gangster Volume 2, High School Debut, Three in One Edition Volume 2, Knights of Sidonia Volume 9, Ottoman Volume 18, Phantom Thief Janine Volume 2, Pokemon Adventures Volume 22, Run the Half, Two in One Edition Volume 2, Strobe Edge Volume 10, the Art of Princess Mononoke and What Did You Eat Yesterday Volume 2. Right, so on to the news. The Patmore Invited Kickstarter finished yesterday and raised over 200% of their target funding, hitting £38,265. This is without taking the backers into account, so hopefully we hit the 40k stretch goal mark altogether, or close enough to make the soundtrack an actual possibility. Since Anime Limited, we're still trying to get it, so congrats to the guys over at the company and to us who backed it. It looks like we'll be getting the ultimate or definitive edition, whatever they're calling it, hopefully by the end of September. Also, Kuroko no Basket or Kuroko's Basketball's third season was given the green light last week and this was announced in Japan's Shonen Jump. So the broadcast times and dates will be announced in future issues of Weekly Shonen Jump in Japan and it's not been that long since the second season finished. But like, why end it in the middle of a tournament? Like, that's just torture on people who don't read the manga like me, just because I like to keep myself on edge when I'm watching the anime. That's, I mean, like, come on, this is kind of a hint to bring the manga out over here. I mean, it would be popular, especially with girls, and like, I think it's an amazing series, so I'd definitely buy it. The One Piece manga takes a two-week break due to Oda Sensei having his tonsils removed. He's quoted on the matter, since last year I've tended to get swollen tonsils whenever I get tired. The surgery I'm having this time will take up the tonsils, which really hindered my work. Since I'm having the surgery, I'm having a bazooka installed onto my shoulder. <laughs> I think he's going for the Frankie look. Uh, the manga has been on hiatus before due to an infection caused by tonsillitis. Hopefully you will get better soon and has a speedy recovery, not just for the fact that I missed the manga. Just get better soon, Oda Sensei. <laughs> also, Netflix will be streaming Halloc Space Pirate from August 1st. This, and I'm sure that I mentioned that there were going to be simulcasting Knights of Sidonia, but that was a long time ago and it didn't seem to happen as the anime is currently airing in Japan. And instead, they have simulcasting it, they will they have acquired the rights to stream it after it's run in Japan. So you can look forward to seeing that in the next couple of months, I guess, since it should 
maybe it's like, I don't know, I'm not sure how many episodes it's going to be, but if it's 12 episodes, then it will be finishing probably around June 10th, no, July 10th, sorry. And I don't have any game news for you this week, guys, so the deal of the week is for Iki Tozen, Dragon Destiny, the complete collection, this is on DVD and contains all 12 episodes of the series, plus the 6 OVA episodes. This is on 3 discs and will cost you £9.99 instead of £29.99, which is a saving of 67%, and this is pulled from Anime Online. So go check that out if you're interested, and with that, that's it for this week's webcast. Thank you for watching, guys. As usual, all links are in the description below. Leave a like, favourite and subscribe if you wish and leave a comment in the comment section telling us what you thought of the episode and what I can do to make things better as a whole. Hopefully this was a quick episode as it's quite late at night that I'm recording this one I'm probably making a bit too much noise. So yeah, uh, thanks for watching I sh and I shall update you again next week. Bye!